Good evening, Mayor and President of the City Council. Thank you for honoring the state of California's designation of August being Muslim Appreciation and Awareness Month. This is the eighth year this designation has occurred in California, and we truly appreciate the Pleasant City Council presenting this proclamation today for the fourth year. I'm representing Pleasant Hills Muslim Community Center, also known as MCC. The MCC is a vibrant regional mosque and community center located on West Las Positas Boulevard since 2010. During that time, MCC has been providing services not only to the Muslim community, but also to the entire Tri-Valley community. While we're doing our best to navigate through these uncertain times, we're encouraged to see the city councils in Pleasanton, Dublin, San Ramon, and Livermore recognize that we are part and parcel of the greater community and that we are appreciated. That truly means a lot to the approximately 20,000 residents who are Muslim in the Tri-Valley. American Muslims have lived in and contributed to their community since our country's founding. MCC has hosted multiple Girl Scout troops as well as an entire pack of Cub Scouts, some of whom are in attendance tonight. I'd like to encourage all of them to rise. And there's chairs over here. If you'd like to come in and have a seat. We aim to teach our Scouts about community and civic responsibility to not only our community, but to the community at large. Having been a Pleasanton resident for seven years, I've had positive interactions with many representatives in your public schools, the fire, the police department, the public works, parks and recreation. I like to see that there's many police officers here and I very much enjoy bringing my children to ice cream with a cop and donuts with a cop. Mm -hmm. I look forward to that and seeing that more as well. We uh, even have some firefighters here Oh, too, firefighters as well. <laughs> Love having the firefighters host our children at field trips um, at, for both our scouts as well as for our schools. So thank you for that as well. However, we do hear from congregation members, including women wearing their faith on their heads in the form of a headscarf as they walk down the streets and malls and shopping centers of this progressive bubble we live in the Bay Area, feeling intimidated by an unfriendly stare, a racist comment, or an intimidating approach. For our students, a study by the Council of American Islamic Relations reports 49% of American Muslim students having experienced some type of bullying at school. And what's worse, amongst those, 38% of students saying that they have experienced bullying from their own teachers. And the workforce employees and applicants who are Muslim have filed lawsuits against employers based on religious discrimination. We hope that this will not occur here in this fine city. This is why today's proclamation is so important and why we need you to continue to speak up when you hear whispers or comments that can tear apart the beautiful civic fabric in Pleasanton. Please speak up when a, if a mosque gets vandalized or a Muslim child is bullied. Please help bring light to disputes that may be more than just neighborly. For elected officials and law enforcement, please use your role in the community to help speak up for our future Muslims, as you see here. This makes a world of difference for your constituents who are Muslim. On behalf of Pleasanton Muslims, we thank you for this proclamation and recognition. All right, would you like to stay there and we'd like to come up and take a picture with anyone who would like to join? That would be fantastic. And I'll hand you the proclamation. Thank you so much. Have all the scouts come up? Scouts. Now it'll be a lot of stuff. 